Yeah, right now the road 356th drive southeast is open. That could soon change. It's all because of this slow moving ground underneath the road. It's virtually split the street in half. We know this road leads to about more than 60 homes and a slow moving slide could cause dozens of people to become trapped if the ground moves anymore. So crews have been monitoring this area closely for the last week or so, and it's gotten to the point where it's time to encourage people to get out if they choose to. Now this slide is moving so slow, it's hard for crews to gauge what exactly is going to happen. That's a potentially dangerous situation for people who could be trapped. There is no other way out of this area. About an hour ago, King County officials held a press conference to get everyone up to speed. We have a soil expert coming in tomorrow to do some test borings, but in an abundance of caution, we really wanted to get ahead of this and notify homeowners and give them the chance to get out before. Yeah, there really is no idea just yet how many people will choose to leave because of this uh, voluntary ev evacuation. But I did speak with one woman who made the hike up to her home. She has a farm on this road and she says she can't leave. She takes care of animals and a lot of her neighbors do the same things. A lot of her neighbors have farms as well and they are planning to stay. Of course, this is something we will continue to stay on top of as a lot of people are trying to figure out what they're going to do in this situation. But again, this road completely split in half right now as officials are monitoring what the ground could do. For now, we are live in Fall City, Britmore, King 5 News.